days ago I received an email from Gareth Brandwood asking me to come and see a machine that he has that he's trying to legalise on the streets of Britain. There is no doubt that the Segway and machines like it are the way forward if we're to tackle global warming and all the problems the planet are experiencing at this moment. This form of transportation is relatively new and unfortunately current legislation doesn't allow anything other than invalid carriages to be used on pavements. Uh, so the campaign is aiming to have legislation changed, primary legislation, so that an exception can be made so that people are free to use these if they want to. Can you explain to me how it actually operates? Does it have a key? Yep, it's got a, a wireless key which you can either attach to the machine on here or you keep it in your pocket, wear it around your neck or attach it via a watch strap to your wrist. And the key gives you information about how fast you're going, how much battery power you've got left and using a very simple user interface it tells you whether there's any problems with the device using a smiley face. If it's smiling you know there's no problems. If it starts to frown the machine will start to shake and beep and you know you've got a problem. But, uh... <laughs> the lock button on the key and that wirelessly turns on the alarm on the machine. Hear the beep. Any movement of the machine then causes it to beep. Anybody trying to move it has a real struggle pulling it because the wheels are locked. Okay, Nearly killed cat, the cat. Kill <laughs> so when you stop, can you actually Oh, I'm going back. Just right forward, shift your weight. That's it. So you take one foot off. Yeah. Having tried the Segway for myself, I'm convinced it's the way forward, especially in this climate of global change and global warming. James Barm, Warrington.tv, Beauty.